Okay, so let's work on some of these so-called density problems. So the first problem that we have here, find the density of a 2.75 kilogram substance that occupies a volume of 230.0 cubic centimeters. So we can write here what, 2.75 kilogram, and then we multiply it with one kilogram we have, a thousand times, because you want the density to be times per cubic centimeter. And then we can put everything over to 30.0 cubic centimeters. If you're going to look at the unit that you have there, you will have gram per cubic centimeter. Okay. So 2.75 times a thousand, so that's 6,750 divided by 230. So three significant figures, so you will get around 11.0 grams per cubic centimeter. Okay, now the next one, find the volume occupied by 250 decibel grams there of oxygen with a density of 0 0.00134 grams per ml. So we can go the definition density equals to mass over volume and the one that we ask is the volume. So rearranging this thing, B times V over M and then divided by B, okay? Oh, not B, D. So we're going to what we could replace it with what we have. So the mass is 250 grams over 0 0.00134 grams per ml. So if you're going to look at that, so you're going to have a unit on um, this thing. And you're going to have a big number here because big number divided by small number. So if you're going to have the calculator, this is most likely the one that will come out. So significant figures for here, three on this one. So you can round it up as 1.87 times 10 to the five ml. Now, last but not the least, you're asked to find the mass of silver with a density of 10.5 grams per cubic centimeter that occupies 965 cubic centimeters. So again, density mass over volume. So the one that we ask you is mass. So you just have it like this one. So you have a density that's 10.5 grams per cubic centimeter. Multiply it with nine. 165 cubic centimeter. So you're going to have an answer here around most likely like this. Now, if you round it up, you might round it like uh, 101100 zero, zero grams or 1.0 times 10 to the four one two so this will be what we call answer to a question like this, okay?